Hey everybody, my name is Richard Van Camp. I'm from Fort Smith, Northwest Territories. I live in Edmonton. And this is a graphic novel that I wrote with an artist named Crystal Mateus. It's called Three Feathers. We're really proud of it because this graphic novel is based on a true story that happened in my hometown of Fort Smith, Northwest Territories. Long time ago, there were three young men that were robbing all of us. They got my house a couple times. We have a beautiful log house in Fort Smith. But one day, they were in a house and they surprised an elder in the back room. And the elder thought it was, he was having a nap. He thought it was his grandkids. So he comes out to say hi. They get into a horrible fight. This is all true. And uh, the elder suffered a heart attack and a stroke. As a result of these three boys being caught by the authorities, they were all sent down south to jail for two years each. I followed the trial in the paper and the boys said, number one, we went into business for ourselves because we were always starving. Our parents were never home. And I thought to myself, you know, we're gonna send these young people down south for two years. It's always two years. What if we sent them out on the land? What if we trusted them and taught them their language? What if we taught them how to hunt? What if we taught them how to provide for their future families? What if we, we just gave them the gift and the responsibility and the teachings of what it means to be a young man today in the Northwest Territories? I started to work on Three Feathers. I could see the opening. I could see three boats that were just heavy with moose meat and medicines and rat root. And I could see the three boats heading back to Fort Smith. And I could see three young men who had transformed. So this graphic novel means the world to me because it's the first graphic novel I've been able to put in our hometown of Fort Smith. It's a joy when people turn the page and they say, oh, there's our water tower, there's our church, there's our rec center. I'm just over the moon. I'm grateful to you all. Masi Cho, have a wonderful day.